All right, I don't get much time, man. Um, let me say this. Sometimes racism is not wrong. Sometimes racism is not wrong. Hear me when I say this, brother. I played the trombone from the fifth grade to the 11th grade in high school. I was decent. I wasn't the best, but I was, I was, I was kind of good, right? So true story. One day, my band director calls me into his office, white German dude, whatever, right? So he says, Dave, close the door. I'm like, oh shit. I didn't, am I in trouble? Like, I don't know what's going on, right? He said, Dave, you got some big ass lips, right? And I'm not lying. He said, I think you would be an amazing tuba player because I think that your lips would be better served for a bigger mouthpiece. And I'm like, nigga, I should beat your ass. Like, 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 well, like, like right now on site, like, like this shit is fucked up. How dare you, how dare you suggest that I put my lips on a bigger mouthpiece because you think I would be great, right? He handed me this mouthpiece. And he said, try it. And the way my Negro lips wrapped around the edge of this mouthpiece, I felt like when King Arthur pulled out Excalibur. And, and, in the sword in the stone, like I was like, oh my God. I felt so much power. I went from being a mediocre trombone player to first chair, Chicago, all city, Kathy Otterman, right? In two months, first chair. I'm a goddamn prodigy on the tuba. I go back to homecoming 20 years later, same white dude. I say, hey man, Mr. Bim, thank you for introducing me to the tuba. And he was like, I told you, nigger. Like, like, you, you. <laughs> Sometimes racism is not wrong. I, I, I'm trying to tell you. Thank you, love. Thank you. Don't fall, but thank you. Thank, thank you. Okay.